Assalamu alaikum. Hey everyone, this is Amin and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this YouTube channel, now I will share another web scrapping tutorial. Before starting the tutorial, I am requesting you if you are new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and share this video to your Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, WhatsApp, and other social media so that other people can also learn from this video. And after watching this video, if you have any question about this video and the, about the software, please comment on the video. And if you need my service at a very cheap rate, you can contact me. All my contact details you will find on the video description below, also on my YouTube channel cover page. So friends, let's start the tutorial. First of all, you have to download and install the Octopath software and I have already show the process how you can download and create the account on the octopus.com it is is very easy uh, so i hope you have successfully created and download the software on your computer and currently i am using the 8.5.2 version of the octopus software so this is everything you will find and i will give that website link on the video description below for your easy access after successfully downloading and installing the software on your uh, computer uh, here you see that this is the uh, this is the interface of the octopus software i will find everything here when you log into your octopus software and here i just want to show you how you can easily scrap data without any kind of coding or anything to scrap data first of all you have to uh, here search for text template or enter the website url from where you want to get data i want to get the data for example here you see that i have already showed this in my previous video and now i also want to show the technique in this video okay just i just write my target keyword on that section dentist and here my target location then click on here find when you click on find then you will see that we found the targeted dentist on the dallas texas area just copy this link so this will be our starting link after that just this link paste it here okay just paste it here and click on start when you click on start here you see that this space is loading here okay you see that this page is loading here so it is just loaded here okay we found this on here one so this one is the page one and page two and um, page two uh, page, page two means number two okay so here you see one option that auto detect web page okay I, I as i have already working on it so you already see this one but in case in your pc maybe it will not like that one okay so i just want to show you that uh, auto click on here auto detect web page data if you don't already run on it so when you click on auto detect web page data maybe it is if it is normally on default format but if it is not on then just on it here okay so when you click on here auto detect page this means this uh, software will automatically detect the data that normally uh, people want to scrap from this website it will detect the page name here you see that business name and all the selected data that are in uh, in other color from the website you see that the website the data that are already selected in other color here you see that so these are the all the auto detected uh, these are all the data that this software has been auto detected okay so after getting all the data here okay you will see another option swiss auto detect uh, result page one by five so here i want to show that these are total five pages here and all the pages are auto detected and it's already telling this one okay this one okay after that as it is uh, here you will find two options page in to scrap more page and here add a page scroll uncheck this one and okay this one and then uh, check this one okay okay this one is okay then click on here uh, create workflow when you click on create workflow you see that here 
a workflow is uh, already created here okay if you don't see it here okay if you don't see the workflow here click on here okay show the workflow you see that these are the uh, uh, these are the icons you will see hide workflow or this is the uh, hide the this one okay so i just click on this icon and it show the workflow here so here you see that it is auto detected and this workflow is successfully created here you can check the workflow here just click on here go to website i am just checking it here okay if you click on here go to website that means it is just going to the website then the pagination that means pagination means this one this page one selection one two three four five this one is called the pagination section and after pagination a loop item okay loop item means it will extract the data and this process will be uh, processing loop item and extract that and click to the next this system will be applied okay after that here click on here uh, save when i click on save here okay this data is now saved now i want to run it on my computer then click on here run when you click on here run you will find two option run on your device and run in the cloud section okay here some feature of octopus is still missing and you will find this feature when i will create the advanced mode you will find an option here boost your speed okay so it is not uh, it is not already appeared here i just want to open it here run now you can also run a schedule okay here just click on here run now when you click on run now you see here that i am showing you this pop-up window will appear and it will show what data already is scrapping from that section i just want to uh, make everything clear so that it will only scrap the data that are uh, publicly available here so here you see that it is just scrapping and the speed is super i will see that 30 data has been extracted easily okay you see that and each page here showing the uh, 10 result that's reason we found 60 data has been extracted that means two pages has been extracted this way it will be continued and one more thing i just want to show you that although you already show the uh, data preview here but i want to stop this and want to show you the result okay uh, just waiting for you okay click on here stop and click on here confirm and want to export the data here okay no duplicate already found here export when i click on export data it is just uh, okay you see here this page uh, pop-up window is appeared i want to again want to uh, export in excel format okay click on export and okay i just want to write it here uh, just 222 okay this 22 and click on it is exporting want to open the file here and here you see that we found all the data here we found the title the title url this that means the business url image these are the same thing and uh, these are the uh, these are the categories url categories url also so these are the uh, data we found here so this is the total thing i just wanted to explain in this video if you think it is something helpful to you please share this video comment on the video and pray for me see you in the next video bye